One of the things that we must do before we start giving you a lesson is to determine your dominant eye. It's very important because some people's dominant eye is their right eye and some people have a dominant eye as their left eye. Most of the time, a right-handed person would have a right eye dominance and a left-handed person would have a left eye dominance. But there are several occasions where that is not true. So we must determine which your dominant eye is regardless of whether you're left-handed or right-handed. The way we do it is very simply. We have the person stand in front, making an overlap design of the hands with a hole. Then bringing the hole up to the eye, I can look through the hole and see that she is right eye dominant because that's the eye that she's looking at me with. And then place the arms down again. Now, some people doubt what I'm telling them. And what I'm saying is you only see out of one of your eyes. It's the dominant eye. To prove that, when you do the dominant eye test again, when you are looking at me, I tell the person to close your dominant eye. In this case, it would be your right eye. So bring the hole up, close your right eye, and I've disappeared out of the hole. Because even though you've brought the hole up to my eye with both eyes open, when you close off the dominant eye, that's the eye that's looking through the hole. That's what you're seeing with. With both eyes open, you're gonna raise your arms up with the hole focused on the camera, looking through the hole, then close off your dominant eye, your right eye, and the camera disappears. And the camera can see that you're closing off your dominant eye. And then come back to rest again.